but I'm happy that we can still do our Bible stories. Um, last week we talked about how Mary honored Jesus by washing his feet with her perfume. And this week our Bible story is about a time when people said, praise you Jesus. So our story starts out, um, people were walking to Jerusalem with Jesus to celebrate a happy holiday. Do you think these people were just as excited about their holiday as we are about Easter? Jesus pointed to a little town nearby. He said to his friends, go to this town. You will find a donkey. Bring him to me. Jesus' friends walked to the town. They found a donkey just as Jesus had said. The men led the donkey to Jesus. Some of Jesus' friends put their coats on the donkey. Now Jesus could ride the donkey to Jerusalem. Clippity-clop, clippity-clop. Hee-haw! Jesus' donkey trotted towards Jerusalem. The people traveling to Jerusalem walked along the road. Some of them had been sick, but Jesus had made them better. Some of them could now run to meet Jesus because he had healed their legs. Let's make Jesus king, someone said. To welcome Jesus into Jerusalem, some people took off their coats and laid them on the road in front of the donkey. Other people quickly cut off branches from trees nearby and spread the branches on the road. Some people waved the tree branches and shouted, Hosanna, praise you Jesus. Blessed is he who comes in the name of the Lord. On that happy, exciting day, the people welcomed Jesus as king. How does it make you feel that we can praise Jesus too? Okay, so I'm going to ask you some questions and you can discuss these with your family. What did Jesus tell his friends to bring him? What did some people do when they saw Jesus coming riding on a donkey? What did some other people do? What did people shout when they waved tree branches? And how can we praise Jesus? So we're gonna say our prayer. Jesus, we are glad that we can praise you. Thank you, Jesus, for loving us. We love you, amen. I really miss you guys. I hope that your families and you are doing well. Uh, I'm praying for you. I'm praying for any boo-boos, any sicknesses, any sadness. Just know that Miss Jennifer loves you and she's praying for you. And I hope you have a wonderful week.